Hey everyone, it's Master Aquatics and I'm bringing you guys another video. Just giving you guys a quick update on the indoor pond that I made from my bathtub. I know some of you guys were saying it's a goofy idea, some of you guys were saying it was cool. I mean, it's not going to be like a permanent thing. I just thought it'd be cool to do for a video and to do for you guys. But I've had it for, for four days now and uh, I haven't had any issues with it. You know, a lot of you guys were worried about the beneficial bacteria and the substrate being destroyed by the tap water. Um, some of you guys are saying I didn't put any dechlorinator in the water. Um, I guess I should have included footage of me doing that. Anytime I add new water to an aquarium or anything that's housing fish, I always add prime dechlorinator. That's my go-to whenever I'm doing any type of water changes, small or big, I always add the chlorinator. Matter of fact, I order mine through Amazon. You can get yourself some Prime down in the link, down in the description. Just click on the link and order yourself some. So at first, all I put in was some rosy red minnows. I was pretty confident that the substrate alone was going to make sure that the water was going to be okay and safe for the fish. And of course, while I was adding the bathtub water, I was you know, using Prime and getting rid of the chlorine in the water. So that definitely helped preserving and keeping the destroying of beneficial bacteria to a minimum. Now, one thing that I don't feel too confident about is the plants that are in here. Uh, the reason being is because I don't have proper lighting in here. Even though these are hardy plants, I don't think bathroom lighting is sufficient for them to grow. They definitely have the nutrients, you know. All they need is fish waste and uh, fish food and they will be okay. Um, that's not how you want to grow them at 100% but they will do fine in those conditions. Um, these are very hardy plants, low light plants but you know the light in here is turned off most of the time because it's the bathroom and the lights are only turned on whenever I use the bathroom. They're not going to get too much lighting so I don't think they're going to do too good in here because of that reason. All I'm using for this okay is this right here just this air pump alone okay and it has like two outlets with airline tubings now originally I only had one in use and it was just powering this sponge filter but then I decided to add uh, another airline tubing connected to a air stone and I decided to put an air stone in here as well. I think air stones do a lot of good for the aquarium. Like they provide surface agitation and they provide oxygen. Pretty soon I'm gonna go ahead and start adding air stones to all my aquariums because I just feel like um, filtration is not enough. You need to provide uh, not just clean water but just oxygen for the fish. So I think I'm gonna start doing that. But anyway, so that's what I'm running in here. Air stone, sponge filter, um, let me go ahead and show you guys the fish that I added in here and let me know what you guys think, okay? So far I like my little pond. Um, the water is definitely cold. I don't feel comfortable putting a heater in here. So I don't think I'm going to be getting any like tropical fish. I honestly feel like I should get some more calico goldfish. I don't know if I really want to keep this because I don't know how long this PVC cloth is going to hold. 
So, I mean, so far everything is fine. Like, I haven't had any issues whatsoever except for the fact that I smell like cut up rotten onions. That's the only issue. Everything else is fine. Fish are doing fine. I just throw a little bit of bug bites in here. The goldfish like it. The rosy red minnows like it. Everything is just peachy over here, man. If you guys think I should continue to not shower and keep this pond, let me know what you guys think. Um, and please let me know soon guys because I, I don't know how long I can go without a shower Like I just I feel so icky right now. If you guys want me to get more goldfish in here Let me know if you like this video leave a like subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys in the next one take care and Peace out guys